Well, have you ever wondered what it would be like to be a cowboy? Well, there's probably no better place than Oklahoma to find that out. Thanks to a new reality TV show on the cable network CMT, that question is being answered each Friday night as contestants compete in a new show called Cowboy U. Our Kathy Holsenbeck caught up with the TV crew as they were shooting the series on a working ranch in western Oklahoma. Oh my God, these are 1,200-pound animals. Can we take it easy? I already feel like a cowboy. They have the hats, boots, cowboy gear, and even horses. Oh, Joe's getting trampled. Uh, this is going to be bad. But they're a long way from being called a cowboy. Uh, none of these people are going to go home and be real working ranch cowboys, but they're all going to go home a little stronger. They're all going to go home knowing themselves a little better than they did when they came here. And that's what the show's about. The show is in its fifth season. After taping episodes in California, Arizona, Texas, and Hawaii, producers chose Oklahoma over nine other southwestern states. Flying W is amazing. The people that run it are unbelievable. They're, you know, they open the front door for us and just help us out any way we can. The ranch has got everything a cowboy needs. You know, it's an authentic ranch, so you know it's already up and running. We just kind of come in and blend it right in. The cast stayed close to the Flying W while the crew and their money stayed in nearby Sare. The development of the Flying W in Beckham County is going to do a lot for the county. This, this one deal, they'll probably spend at least $500,000 this month in this county and uh, they figure the impact, it turns over over seven times in a county. So when you multiply 500,000 by seven, you get about a three and a half million dollar impact for the state of Oklahoma. And Oklahoma is having an impact on the crew. <laughs> I didn't know much about Oklahoma. This is my first visit to Oklahoma. And it's, it's just beautiful. The sunrises and sunsets are, we're all remarking, just the most beautiful we've ever seen. And the, the land is terrific, and the people just couldn't be nicer. We couldn't feel more welcome anywhere than we have been here. The Cowboy U cast and crew spent three weeks at the Flying W, working two shifts to get the job done. They truly got a taste for what it's like to be an Oklahoma cowboy. The weather's been up and down. It's, it's been hot, cold, wet, dry. Um, you know, it's dusty one day and muddy the next. So it's kind of an authentic experience for the sea slickers to come in and, and uh, you know, especially in the fall, get a feel for what it's like on a ranch. And the winneries made sure the folks from Cowboy U had everything they needed. They built a bunkhouse especially for the contestants and an outdoor shower. Not so much for convenience, but to see how tough the contestants were. I think uh, the I think you see slickers, you know, they really respect the cowboy way of life when they leave the show. When they first get here, I don't think they realize how hard a cowboy works, how much is involved in taking care of a, a, a working ranch. So by the time they leave here, they have a new respect for the cowboy way, and I think they, they take the work ethic with them to the city. Everyone talked about the beauty of the Flying W, but what I found was the people. Uh, we were so welcome here, but we found friendship and long-lasting relationships, and this, this has been an experience I'll remember my whole life.